हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई एम अजय करमरकर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग फर्दर आई वुड लाइक टू से समथिंग प्लीज वॉच वीडियो कंप्लीटली एंड सीट विथ कॉपी पेन इफ यू फाइंड सम वेयर इंपॉर्टेंट देन प्लीज नोट इट एंड प्रोसीड फर्दर ऑल दो यू हैव फेसिंग एनी प्रॉब्लम और डिफिकल्टीज प्लीज राइट इन कमेंट बॉक्स आई डेफिनेटली सॉल्व यूर प्रॉब्लम एंड अलॉन्ग विथ प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब बिकॉज that can reach more and more students okay thank you here what the question says let a total charge 2q be distributed in a sphere of radius capital r with the charge density given by rho is a function of r equal to kr where r is the distance from the center two charge a and b of minus q h are placed on diametrically opposite points at equal distance a from the center if a and b do not experience any force then you have given four options that is uh, first option a equal to 8 raised to power minus 1 by 4 by uh, into r option b a equal to 3 r By two raised to power one by four, option C a equal to two raised to power minus one by four r, option D a equal to r by root three. This question is asked J M S twenty nineteen. Before solving this question, let us first we have to understand the gist of this question. What is the question actually want to say? Here you have given a sphere which having the total charge is 2q inside the sphere equal charges equal same charges situated at the position a and b its distance is a distance from the center okay both are equal means 2a total distance is 2a and this distance from the center is a here actually repulsion force equal to attraction force from the upper side to this side so here we can get the relation among this four okay so this is the basic or central idea of this question now first of all we have to find out the electric field from 0 to a radius but before starting we have to find out the relation between the charge and density here you know that very well here the density Rho equal to charge upon volume. This is volumetric object. You have given spherical object, so therefore we have to return here volume. Otherwise, there are three types of density: charge density, linear charge density, surface charge density, and volumetric charge density. Now sigma, and what is the charge? You have given the charge. Let us suppose. dq because we have considered this is well, uh, this is element element shell okay dq and uh, volume in this case here we have taken shell the area of the shell is 4 pi r square and the width is dr now dq equal to rho 4 pi r square dr and uh, rho rho is given in k into r so substitute this value k r 4 pi r square dr dq k 4 pi r cube dr now integrate both the side here what is the limit here the limit is 0 to r because total charge and what is the total charge on this dq is 0 to 2q so now k 4 pi r raised to power 4 upon 4 here r and 0 dq can be written as q and what is the value of q 2q because 2q is already you have given so substitute this value 2q equal to k 
फोर फाइव आर फोर अपॉन फोर दिस फोर एंड दिस फोर विल बी कैंसल आउट नाउ द वैल्यू इज के इक्वल टू टू क्यू फाइव आर एस टू पावर फोर नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड फ्रॉम द दिस एलिमेंट शेल देन वॉट इज द फॉर्मूला बाय यूजिंग गॉस थ्योरम E into a one upon epsilon zero times of total charge. Previously we have to already find out the same process. So therefore you are well known about that zero to a k four pi r cube d r. Same process we have done here. K four pi r cube d r. E what is the area of the shell? Four pi a square. Because we have to take here the radius is. A, okay, one upon epsilon zero times. Now, k. What is the value of k? Zero to a, and value of k is two q pi r is to power four four pi r cube dr. Pi pi gets cancelled out. E four pi a square. One upon epsilon zero times two q and uh, four to the eight four to the eight q and r raised to power four taken outside of this integration and the remaining terms is r q and d r then uh, e into four pi a square. One upon epsilon zero times eight q r is to power four here r zero to a square. r is to power four upon four. Put the value of upper limit and zero uh, lower limit. Okay. Now the steps continue. E equal e into four pi a square equal to one upon epsilon naught. Eight q r is to power four and put the limit a is to power four upon four. Okay, e equal to one upon epsilon naught eight q four pi a square r is to power four and a is to power four upon four. Four to the eight. And two ones are two, two twos are four. Here a square, here a is to power four. Only two is remaining. E equal to here q a square epsilon naught pi r is to power four and two. This is the electric field. We have to find out the electric field. Now the attraction force. Attraction force. We can find out the attraction force between a or b. You can take any one of them. So now, attraction force force equal to E into Q. So what is E? Here E is Q A square two epsilon naught pi r s to power four multiplied by Q. Then this force consider F one. Attraction force is F one. Now Q square A square two epsilon naught pi R is to power four. This is F one. Now for repulsion force between A and B, that is considered F two one upon four pi epsilon naught. What is the charges? Same charges, negative charges Q square. And what is the distance? The distance from the center is A. Then the whole distance diametrically means two A. Then two a square. Then f two equal to q square four pi epsilon naught four a square. It is f two. Now, according to the given condition, what is the condition is given? A and B do not experience any force. It means f one and f two are equal. So q square a square upon two epsilon naught pi r raised to power four equal to q square. Four pi epsilon naught four a square. Here 
you can see that q square q square cancel out here too so multiply by two numerator and denominator then it become four pi epsilon naught cancel out and uh, now Now, 4 to the 8, a raised to power square and square, a raised to power 4. Here, r raised to power 4 reaches to the numerator of the right side. Okay, a raised to power 4, r raised to power 4 by 8. Then it can be written as a equal to r and 8 raised to power 1 by 4, fourth root. Okay, and uh, but in the answer, according to you can see, 8 can be written as minus 1 by 4 by using exponent tool. And this is the answer. So, this is the correct answer. I hope so you understand this question. Now, thank you for staying till the end of this video. And yes, I remind you again, don't forget to subscribe my channel. That can reach more and more students. And I will get the energy for making new videos. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.